It's been a successful time for Neil Fanner in his Brayton based gym. Martin Ward's going for an English title, Gary Fox is going for an area title, and now the most successful boxer in Hartlepool history is ready to rumble. And uh, we've got Michael Hunter making his comeback now in your gym. Is that, is that an honour for you? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm pleased, you know, because uh, he still showed his face in the gym and trained, but, you know, obviously half hearted, and, you know. But, um, and I think that's like a compliment to our gym that he still wanted to be a part of the team, and he said, I've still got the hunger, you know, and I said, well, it took. The decision was his, really, and then once he said he was going to make a comeback, obviously, I've got to back him all the way. Yeah, and he's, he's training hard. You can see him, he's getting in shape now. He trains very hard, you know, that uh, he, he's always been a good trainer, you know, and uh, he showed the commitment to, uh, to get back, so hopefully onwards and upwards. Good luck to him as well. Yeah. So after seven belts and a glittering career, Michael's ready to come back. He's got the backing from his coach, but is the man himself ready? Mike, are you looking forward to your next show? Can't wait. Back to the bar hall. Uh, got some great nights there. Uh, I'm going to turn it back on, give, uh, give me loyal fans another ride. And you've been training with Neil for long now, or is it a couple of weeks? Or? No, no, it's, it's, it's been actually, uh, well, by the time I get in the ring, it'll be, it'll be five and a half months I've trained. So it's not as if I've just jumped out, come from nowhere, and, and thought, right, I take weeks to the show, blah blah. blah we'll, we'll, we'll get back in. But I've been training behind closed doors for like nearly five and a half months when it comes. And you say you've got some great memories in the Barrow Hall. Is it time to bring them back and resurrect them in the next show? Oh, definitely. You know, I feel warm of fights, and, and I'll be back to my very best. Uh, and obviously, we've got home, home, home advantage with the Barrow Hall, and uh, just just hoping that a good crowd turns out, just like the old days, and. And we'll get some started again. And you've been training with uh, Neil's other lads, Gary Fox, Martin Ward, Chris Burton. How much of an influence do you think you're having on them? Oh, brilliant! You know, uh, I watch, I watch, I used to watch them when I'd said I retired, uh, and I used to think, "Wow, I wish I could get back in that shape." Mm -hmm. And obviously, watch them and, and keep watching them. And I wanted to do, come back myself and do it and finish finish the career what like it started instead of going out on a on a on a, on a loss which I shouldn't have lost in the first place. And it being too weird trained. Because it was a bit of a disappointing end, so is it time to sort of bring back the memories that you had of the good days? I'm just going to amend it, amend it on a fine career, and uh, obviously put everything, put, uh, put everything back in place, and just just round it all off. And I've have a couple of great nights back in Hartlepool Pole, and, and and for the loyal fans, and and we'll get some up and runs. Just just see how far we can go, you know. And what about Neil? How much of an influence is that on yourself coming back? Neil's Neil's great. Neil's great. Been always been great to me. Always looked at me since like like a son. Uh, and we're just, we're just starting to get things back to normal now and uh, go from strength to strength. So Michael's back in shape and he's ready to go. Neil's got other men in his gym though. Over the coming weeks we'll be looking at Martin Ward, Gary Fox and Chris Burton. This is Martin Dunn for the Hartley Pill Mail.